Yo, 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 peeps, how are you all getting on? This is your boy Popsy from Future Shock Studios and welcome back to yet another video. And today we're going to be looking at the Alpaca mic. It's a mic isolation solution, or some call it a mic isolation filter. Let me quickly remove it and show you it in a bit more detail. So you simply just pull it off and this is the size of it in my hand. The removable end cap comes in three colours. We've got the red and black. Let's remove it now. So you just basically pull it off and that's what it looks like in a bit more detail and that's what the alpaca mic looks like from the inside and underneath you get this rubber seal that goes over the mic and it does come in two sizes which I'll discuss a bit later and it simply takes a second to put on let's line it up and just click it on and there you go so as you can see that's the end that you're going to speak from that's the rear end which is also removable the rubber bottom and it is all a 3d printed let's just slide this on top and by the way i am speaking on the aston origin microphone which is an amazing microphone and this is what the audio sounds like let's place this on top now and literally we're good to go and this is what the audio sounds like using the alpaca mic mic solution it's designed with a lining of premium alpaca felt sourced directly from a texas in the usa the material used offers a natural resonance and excellent isolation and it caters to most and i must say most condenser microphones and it simply is a great invention so with that being said let's go and roll the intro Welcome back. If you're new here, do consider subscribing. I bring you news about audio, video and lighting gear each and every week. As for this video, I'll be recording all the audio on the Aston Origin using the Alpaca Mic solution. My recorded voice will be L natural, meaning there's no EQ compression or any type of a noise reduction. Having said that, let's go and see what comes in the box. Everything comes in this eco-friendly packaging. In the box, you'll obviously find the Alpaca Mic Sound Isolation Kit. The isolation kit is available in three colors, red and black, black and the brand new blue and yellow. It's also available in two microphone sizes, a two inch, which will fit microphones between 53 millimeters to 63 millimeter microphones and a two and a half inch microphone, which is around 63 millimeters. The different colors and sizes aren't available separately. So you will have to buy the whole unit as one and if you're interested in buying the alpaca mic mic solution for yourself it will set you back around 144 pounds in the uk and in the us it will set you back around 179 dollars all prices are correct at the time of filming this video as always i'll drop the links in the description down below it's also worth visiting their website alpacamic.com for more information about this and all the other amazing lineup of products moving on let's go and check out the build quality and the features is. As for the build quality, the Alpaca Mic Isolation Kit has a very innovative construction and is made of a 3D printed HD PLA. And trust me, this thing will need a hammer to break. It is very rugged and solidly constructed. Let's put it back on. The insides are lined up with alpaca fiber. Alpacas in general undergo shearing once a year, typically before late July, though timing may vary by location. Alpaca fiber's natural, hyperallergenic and non-toxic properties make it an ideal and safe option for products used in sensitive recording environments, essential for achieving top-notch sound isolation. On both ends, you get removable end caps, which can be swapped over for different colors to suit your studio's aesthetics. On the bottom, you'll find the removable rubber ring, which as already explained, comes in two sizes. Now that you've seen the unboxing, the build quality and the features, let's do the most important thing, testing. This is what the audio sounds like without the alpaca mic. This is what the audio sounds like with the alpaca mic. And now this is what the audio sounds like with a regular pop filter. And this is what the audio sounds like without the regular pop filter. This is a proximity test without the alpaca mic. And now this is a proximity test with the alpaca mic. This is a plosive test without the alpaca mic. Peter Piper picked a peck of a pickled peppers. This is a plosive test with the alpaca mic. Peter Piper picked a peck of a pickled peppers. Let's go and do some vocal recording on the acoustic guitar and uh, Cliff's gonna sing directly into the LA320 by Latin Audio just to see what the difference is with the filter and without the filter. You ready mate? Yep. Let's take it away. Ah. 
the alpaca filter on and uh, Cliff is ready to do the vocal session with his guitar. What guitar is that by the way? This is a Gibson SJ200. There you go peeps, it's the Gibson SJ200 and as you can see we've got the LA320 microphone by Latin Audio and we've got the alpaca filter on there now. Anyway, let's. this is a take two with that just to give you an idea what it sounds like. you understand the things I've done to put me here don't make me less a man hey baby hey, you know I wouldn't lie without a woman no man is satisfied baby I want you to understand the things I've done to put me here Don't make me less a man And baby You know I wouldn't lie Without a woman No man is satisfied So if you're having trouble recording vocals at home and dealing with background noise, pops and echoes, then the Alpaca mic could just be the solution that you've been looking for. And if you're getting ready or planning to record vocals or voiceovers, then the Alpaca mic is a budget-friendly option for you. Hopefully you found this video useful. If you've got any questions, drop me a DM on my Instagram at Futureshock Studios. So anyway, peeps, that's all you're going to get from me for today. Hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Smash it if that's your kind of thing. Subscribe if you aren't already and I shall catch you in the next video. Bye.